right, all you crazy kids, Mark Centerline Systems. Hey, we're gonna do a real short video on our new EDC P. So the P is for like plus because our standard EDC belt is 1.5 inches. The EDC P is a 1.75 inch belt. And so it should be by the time this video is out, the belt should be on the website. You can see all the details there, the sizing, the, and I guess I'll tell you the colors. So here's what we're gonna have for colors. So right now we can do it in uh, Ranger Green, Coyote Brown, Black, and Multicam Black. That's all 1.75. This is a Type 13 uh, mil spec nylon. So it's two layers of that over a layer of 500575 scuba webbing. Um, so you gives you like uh, that nice 1.75 inches, which is like, I think some guys and gals like that a lot more. I'm not gonna lie. I personally just, I really love my regular 1.5, the EDC, P, the EDC belt we make. It does more than all of my, that I need for my uh, everyday carry. But for a lot of guys and gals, you guys want that thicker 1.75. And I'm gonna give a demonstration here in a second. But so by the time of this video, like I said, it'll be on the website. Um, the one color pattern that we don't have uh, right now is Multicam Classic, but that is really not our fault. That's just kind of a manufacturing issue. But once the mill does a run of uh, Multicam Classic in the, one, in the Type 13 nylon, we'll also have that available. So if you're into the Multicams, uh, just stay tuned. And also, uh, a new thing we're doing on all of our belts uh, pages this year is you're going to see uh, pictures specifically of the buckles. So you'll see the buckles on the belts in pictures, but then I've got just specific pictures or pictures just specifically of the different buckles and the different colors so you can better understand. So uh, matter of fact, and that's a good place to just segue in right here. So on our EDCP, one of the main differences between this belt and our Sherpa belt is we're not gonna put, you know, it's the same material that we use on the Sherpa belt, except this belt is this is really designed to be worn, you know, in your on your pants, you know, whether they're salt pants, whether they're blue jeans, if you've got a 1.75 inch belt loop. So that's what it's designed to do. Whereas the Sherpa belt is designed to be worn on the outside of your clothing, right? Like an outdoor belt. We're not going to put one inch uh, webbing on this. This is a, just a standard belt. Now we do have a little wink, wink, nod, nod inside baseball. We are going to have a couple things coming out that are going to allow you to very easily adapt um, and put other items around your waistline to include our puck pouch, which is actually already out. But here, I just wanted you to kind of see the belt one more time. So it's two layers, as I said, of type 13 nylon, sandwiching a layer of 500575 scuba. The belt tip is just a belt tip. So you can see we've got an elastic loop keeper there, you know, to help for belt tip management. But don't forget, that's what your pant loops are also for. Remember those things? Run the belt tip into your pants loop. So this way, you don't have webbing over webbing and smaller webbing to smaller buckles. It's a normal belt. And what I really like about this, so this is a fully loaded handgun, and you can see, as I'm just gonna hold this in a couple different directions, you can see the really nice north-south rigidity. This isn't flopping over like you get on a wet noodle on a belt that doesn't here, and I'm just gonna hold this. If you can see, like I, I mean, that's taken a lot of freaking pressure for me to actually even squeeze that on the north-south. Um, oh, I can't even do it right there. I guess I already used up my one bit of strength, to, you know, kind of squeezing it the first time. I couldn't squeeze it the second time. So it's got on the north-south axis, it's got a ton of rigidity, but it's got all kinds of flexibility on the east-west, which translates to comfort, right? So, you know, I kind of used to say this all the time. So there, you know, I'll say it again. Maybe I need to bring this back. Casual, practical, and tactical, right? That's what you get. So it's an awesome belt. It's casual. It's practical enough for blue jeans. It's practical enough for Carhartts. On the regular EDC belt, I've worn my black one with suits plenty of times, but then it's got more than enough of the, uh, the rigidity that you need for any tactical use or any like, you know, serious everyday carry kind of use that you want to do. Well, let's just keep that so we're not pointing weapons at the camera here. All right, that's it. That's our little um, uh, spiel. But by the time this comes out, EDCP, which is the 1.75, should be on the website. If you've got questions or comments at any point in time, just reach out. I'll do the best I can to help you out. All right, everybody, be your own Paul Revere. 2022, woo!